Alrighty. Part two. Let's see if we can get down the road without getting into the road jam and snow jam and oh my god. The importance of trying to keep a balance between uh, keeping a set of the proper balance and proper separation between work and personal life. Okay. Kyo, I love you, but dude, you gotta give me some space sometimes. Prime example, I get home from work, I'm trying to chill and relax after a long day, and all I'm getting is, oh, excuse me, heartburn. Text message after text message after text message after text message after text message. Dude, I'm lonely. Why did you leave me here? I'm not entertained. What are you doing? How's the wife doing? How's my boss doing? How's this? How's that? I, I know you don't really have a whole lot going on in your life to keep you busy and occupied. But dude, I just got off work. You just spent eight hours with me. I would like to have some downtime. I'm home. I'm home alone. I want some quiet time and just veg out, just, you know, turn on the PlayStation, turn on the PS4 and we'll chat. I don't want to chat. We've been chatting for eight hours. I want to do nothing and just decompress and just vegetate. I'm done working. I don't want to be thinking about work or anything else. I just want to just, you know, downtime vegetate. But, yeah, no, he, uh has a hard time understanding that so I threatened to silence him turn you know turn off notifications for text messages and Facebook Messenger so I don't get his messages well I'll get you on the, on the PlayStation I don't get it turned on I'll get you on Facebook yeah I can silence you there well I'll text you we'll silence you there what are you gonna do nothing <laughs> it's when I'm not at work, I like to have family time. I like to spend time with my family. I want to chill, relax, and vegetate. And just be mellow. And I'm not a huge talker all the time anyhow. I got friends I haven't talked to in three months, for Christ's sakes. And they're the godparents to my kid. So, I gotta be so... Is it that I'm so entertaining that, you know, you want to have something to do with me 24-7, 365? Is that it? Or, or, or what? Am I missing something? Because I don't think I'm that entertaining. So, I'm not saying don't talk to me. I'm definitely not saying don't talk to me. I'm just saying respect the boundaries, you know? Like, give a guy some downtime. Hey, how's it going? Uh, it's going. You feel up to chatting? No, not really. Okay, well, bug you later. You know, let me know when you do feel like chatting. Sure, not a problem. I'll get back to you in a couple hours and I'll probably feel like, hey, dude, I'm bored. What are you up to? I never get a chance to ask him what he's up to because he's always asking me what I'm up to or telling me what he's up to or telling me he's bored or whatever, whatever, whatever. It's like, dude, you know, please, just 20 minutes. But yeah. Depending on your job. I mean, my job's pretty cool because I get to work with, you know, pretty cool guy. So that, you know, and he's a nice kid. He is. That's what makes it really hard to say no sometimes. But sometimes I just get so frustrated because, excuse my language, but there's times when I just want to be left the fuck alone. Not just by him, but by everybody. Everybody in the planet, just leave me the fuck alone. Just, you know turn it off go off the grid and just hibernate you know disappear off the face of the earth for a day or two and just not exist I'm exhausted I need that physical and mental downtime every time I'm talking to him I'm thinking about you know it, it, it puts work on my brain and then things I need to do next time I'm on my next shift stuff I need to do for whatever it's like, oh, I forgot to leave a note for the morning shift. Dang it. I'll text her tomorrow. See? 
talking about it makes me think about work. Make it th and ah, uh, yeah. So try and find a balance. Try and find you know you got to set boundaries and try and find that balance. That's all I'm saying. Everybody's got you know their balance, their what they're willing to and not willing to deal with. So yeah, I'm home. So later.